That's an interesting question. Um, I need to think on my feet a bit. Clearly, we won two awards at Sundance. We won the Jury Prize and we won the Audience Award for World uh, Documentary Cinema. But before that point, I think the film was working only as a word-of-mouth film. Um, it wasn't, there wasn't a lot of kind of ballyhoo going in. It wasn't even seen by many people actually at the festival, but audiences really liked it there. And I think that, combined with the awards, gave us real confidence that the film could have a life in the cinema because people were just really enjoying the movie and talking about it. So clearly Sundance was helpful for that, but for me the discovery was about the audience's reaction, not so much the prizes or the whole business of Sundance. Someone's giving me a call here. I'm just uh, having a press conference, having won an independent spirit award. <laughs> I, I would say that we, so, um, so we, we, we actually went to, we went to Sundance with no hype whatsoever. There was no Sorry? publicity. We went with very low expectations. And as James says, the, the real discovery at Sundance was to find how, how much audiences responded to Philippe's story. It is the most amazing story. And James sort of took it to dizzying new heights. And I think audiences really, really clear, clearly appreciated that and appreciated the fact that this was a story about the Twin Towers that, that never once mentioned 9-11 um, as, like as a story of them growing up rather than coming down. That was my publicist on the phone, just so you know. I have a publicist now, isn't that weird? Uh, and she calls me in the middle of press conferences. Uh, oh, God knows. I mean, um, I mean, it's just great to be there. Uh, I mean, this is the whole thing. Is it's been this sort of fantastic kind of fairy tale for me. Um, I've made films before, and never had this kind of exposure. So, who knows what will happen tomorrow? You know, this is just I'm really enjoying this at the moment. Of course, you wanted to have film, and you know, we scoured every possible kind of angle to find anything. But of course, you know, had it existed, we would have seen it already. And had we had it existed, we'd have seen it a thousand times already. So, in, in, in some respects, just having still images felt really appropriate to what Philippe did, which is to kind of stop time and just sort of create some magical moment for people looking up. So in that respect, you know, I was trying to be true, making a virtue out of necessity, but trying to be true to how I felt the walk was, like a little miracle. And the photographs just sort of captured the miracle in, you know, I think a very beautiful way. Well, it's, it, this is a really, for me, a really great award. It's the independent film, you know, uh, celebration in America. And um, clearly, it's sort of, it feels like the world that you're in has honored you. I'm not part of the Oscar world or the Academy world, but this is a world I am part of, and so to win an award here is, is really special. Well, I hope it means I can make some. <laughs> so, so far, you know, I make a film and, and it sort of ends up, you know, you start again from the beginning and it, it, you have the same battles to fight every single time you make a film. And hopefully this might be a little different this time, but I'll get back to you in a few months. It probably won't be. Thank you very much. Thanks. Okay.